This video will answer the question, what will happen to petrol cars after 2035? Many people ask themselves when petrol cars will be banned in Europe. But there are no plans to ban the use of petrol or diesel cars at any point in time. They can be used until their technical lifetime is over and they simply can't be used anymore. The value of the vehicles is simply too high to just replace them from a, from a particular time in the near future and there is not enough resources to build new vehicles to replace the existing ones. The EU Commission and the UK government have decided to ban the sales of new petrol and diesel cars from 2035. And this means that the vehicle fleets of fossil fuel cars can exist for much longer. We know from the example of Cuba, where many American cars from the 1950s are still in use, that cars can be used for much longer than the average present time of usage of 17 to 18 years. The ban on the sales of new petrol and diesel cars in Europe means that from now and into the future, much fewer new cars will be made than previously. But European car companies will still be able to make such cars for export markets, but none can be sold in the EU or in the UK after the year 2035. This means that a million people or more that are now active in the, the production of car parts systems and in the assembly and design of new cars will be made redundant. Many of these will be needed in the growing sectors of electric cars and in the manufacturing of, of parts for the cars and for chargers and for the expansion of charging infrastructure, power generation and grids but enormous training programs will be needed to reskill and retrain individuals. No such programs are at present available in, or in the planning stages, a fact that is likely to delay the large-scale conversion of transport fleets to electric vehicles. If you want to know more about what is needed for the development of sustainability on a large scale, please make sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel. Mm -hmm.